guys, I'm Samantha here and I'm here. My last name is here, but I'm also here at Oaklawn Park for Life Walk, the walk to end AIDS. And sadly, Brandy couldn't be here today, but I am so excited to be filling in because there are so many cool booths and people and, and dogs, especially dogs. There are so many dogs. So let's go try to find out what's going on. Um, Life Walk is great. Uh, for me and for our organization, we believe in what Prison Health North Texas does for our community, providing um, health services for um, a, a people with HIV AIDS throughout our community in North Texas, actually. Um, and, and all the work they do, especially with the research and providing care for people who don't have the means to uh, receive it. Um, Life Walk has been super exciting this year. Uh, this year, our team has raised over $30,000 for Life Walk through um, a lot of our drag pageant, Miss Big Thicket, that happens every year, and through drag brunches, and our um, amazing singing members who have uh, shared their fundraising pages all over Facebook and through social media. So it's really exciting that we have raised over 30,000. We haven't hit this number ever, really, in the past few years, so it's been fantastic. about my 10th year, give or take a year or two, so I'm really excited about doing it again this year. Yeah. So what kind of significance does LifeWalk have to you? Well, I guess uh, two of them. Uh, one of them is just greater awareness as to, you know, why we're walking and also the state of the technology we hear from, you know, Dr. Carlo and, and all the stage participants. And also, I get to really enjoy watching everybody participate. It's such a community effort. Uh, you know, you see young and old and uh, in, in great harmony just walking around. I think it's just a wonderful thing for me to uh, participate and to photograph. LifeWalk is uh, Prism Health North Texas's large, uh, largest uh, unrestricted fundraising event. But more importantly, it's a way to help the community remember that HIV is still an issue today in our community. And I've heard that um, the money that y'all make here goes to charity. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Actually, yes. Uh, so the money raised uh, for LifeWalk, we have over 100 teams who've been raising money actually probably for the last six months. And it goes to our organization, Prism Health North Texas. We used to be called AIDS Arms. The community probably knows us as AIDS Arms as well. So it's to provide medical care for people who don't have insurance and don't have access to that HIV medical care. This is our 10th year to be at Life Walk, and so we're we're so excited to be here uh, every year, and uh, it's just a great event. Awesome. Can you tell me a little bit about why y'all um, participate in Life Walk? Well, it's a great event. It brings a lot of people from the community, um, a lot of interest and, and uh, advocacy. And so uh, our advocacy, of course, is dogs and dog rescue. Uh, we pull a lot of dogs from local shelters and strays and uh, uh, puppy mill closures and things like that. And so um, we like to uh, bring lots of great dogs here to find forever families. Awesome. Well, what do you think about this, Chuckles? Chuckles <laughs> says, I'm looking for a new home. It's been an amazing day here at LifeWalk, and there are still people signing up behind me. If you would like to know more, you could go to lifewalk.org. And if you'd like us to cover your event, you can go to thedallasvoice.com. From the local scene to your computer screen, I'm Samantha here, and thanks for watching.